we have to admit that the situation is fragile. Uh, we are not united enough, and I feel that we neglected some areas in the past. Because as politicians, we want to be elected, and then we want to be re-elected. And reforms and changes are usually painful, with bad consequences, consequences on people, especially in short run. So now I feel that we face a challenge to take an action. In many areas, we need to take an action. If we, the responsibles, are not courageous enough to take an action, then we create a space for extremists, populists, and nationalists. Look, we are located just in the center, and center usually can divide or unite. Unfortunately, in these days, it seems to me that we represent more a dividing than uniting factor. And th th this is the problem. This is the problem because it is not possible to stay together as Europeans and to answer all the time no. We uh, have the right to answer no, but at the same time, we are obliged to come up with our alternative. And this is the problem. We are perceived in these days not only as migration recalcitrant. I disagree with many approaches when it comes to immigration. But at the same time, I miss any alternative coming from our region. And this is the problem. Sometimes I have a feeling that political leaders in our countries have a problem to understand that smooth exchange of power belongs to our European tradition. And this is the problem. I love power as well. I want it to win election as well. But in case, if I lose election, I should be ready to hand over the power. And even before, we should have a sense for democratic rules. We should have a sense for democratic principles. And one of these principles say that also minorities have some rights. And not only sexual mi uh, minority, but also political minority. It is not enough to win elections. It, it is impossible to think that I win election and I can do everything what I want. This is a huge mistake. And this is one of the reasons why now we face difficulties. Everybody knows that Poland and Hungary are the countries facing Article 7 for the first time in the EU. This is not nice, this is not good. But also political climate in the Czech Republic and in my home is not the best. We should have the respect for the political opposition as well.